Hello everyone, and how's it going? It is November 28th, 2019. It's, I guess, Thanksgiving night right now. And just got home from some family stuff, and the dog is all tired out, so I think it's time for a tech vlog. Well, while I talk, I'll get the computer turned on here. So, um, there it goes. Last tech vlog I did was about a month ago, and unfortunately I ended up not posting it, partially because the clip split itself into two parts because I didn't have my software set up correctly, which was moderately annoying, and second, the audio was terrible because I was filming it with my, well, holding it instead of having it at a gimbal, and I covered up the microphones. So, audio was terrible, video I would have had to edit, and that's... I never posted it. That took a really long time to start going. I hope it's going to work. Um, don't remember where I left off last time, so here's what's going on right now. I don't, again, bear with me if I've talked about any of this, but I'm sure if you're watching a tech vlog, you're used to my rambling. The iMac G3 Graphite 500 megahertz is up on the bench right now. I'm looking for some parts for it. Uh, particularly or in uh, whatever <laughs> I'm looking for the stand still and I'm looking for an optical drive the optical drive that was in it is or was a 4x DVD and it worked kind of but it would never fully eject CDs and when I went to go fix it unfortunately I broke it and it really wasn't repairable so I'm looking for a new um, Oh, just look at that. Black Friday is apparently an event, according to iCal. That's just, that is just something else. Yeah, anyway, um, I literally don't remember what I was just saying. Something about an optical drive. I need a new one, and I've been looking for one that'll work, and I really can't find one on eBay, so... Posting in some Facebook groups recently, trying to find one. Need the stand, I need the optical drive, and I'd like to get two matching sticks of RAM. The one that's, or the two that are in there now, total one gig, which is the max this thing can take, but the, um, they're different speeds, and while that doesn't really matter, I kind of like them to be the same speed, just so it looks a little nicer when I open up the machine. That's really the only reason, but and not really a big deal. So those are the couple things I'm looking for for the iMac G3. Um, the iSub over here, let's take a look at that. I... I'm a bit annoyed. So I thought the power supply was dying, and I, I'm pretty sure it was. So I chopped off the power brick, took a look at the voltages, pin out everything, and found that this old Surface Pro adapter that had a bad connector on the end uh, is able to output what this thing needs. Um, so I, you know, got everything stripped back, got the wires all hooked up properly, plugged it in, and it worked the day that I made it. And then I came down here the next day and it wasn't working again. So I am not really sure what to think. It might just be a software issue, honestly, but. I, I don't know what to think anymore. Um, I guess a good solution would be to find a working power supply, but of course it'll be just as old as the uh, the one that came with this, of course, because it's that's what it is. So it's just as likely to die, is what I'm getting at. I don't know what I'm going to do with this. I might just keep it around because it's cool, or sell somebody on LemSwap. I don't know. I'm it's neat to have, but it is kind of big, and I'm just kind of over it. We'll see what happens with that. The side of the room with all of my stuff stored on it is rather torn apart right now. Part of it's because it's coming up on Christmas time, and I needed to get the lights and hang them on the house before it gets too cold to comfortably do so. So that's what I was doing with all these other boxes, the red box and the cardboard box and something over there. Uh, but the other thing was I'm 
again, thinning out what I've got, so uh, I went through this box that I had down here, and it was just full of things that I, I just don't need. So I found somebody who wanted them, and I'm going to get rid of those. That's pretty much what's going on over here. I've just been pulling things out to see what I've got, as per usual, and uh, setting them aside and not putting them back. That's what that is. There's a projector down there. Got that for free from work. It's uh, an older projector, only 720p. But, man, that thing is incredibly sharp. That was a great joke. Um, there we go, Ken. It's got, it's in general just a really good model of projector. Uh, it's a sharp note vision, and I think they're meant for text clarity, stuff like that. Not only that, but it has a bulb in there which has an estimated 90% life left, which is great. Otherwise, I would not have picked up the projector, but it's in such good shape and has a lot of bulb left, so I'll probably find a use for it at some point might notice something missing over there in the corner. Uh, that would be the server rack. So I went through my server rack, realized that I don't need the server rack. It's taking up a lot of space, a lot of the peripherals in it. I don't use or are, are extremely underutilized and slimmed it down to just this. I won't go into too much detail. I'm going to try to keep this under like eight, nine minutes, but the NAS is now a NAS and virtualization box. So it's got a much faster CPU. I managed to take the CPU out of that HP Elite Desk I had down here, which you may have seen, uh, an i7-4790, and shoved it in there because it's actually compatible with the board. So I got storage and VMs all in one box, the NAS Pro in the middle for backups, and the hard drive on top is a Time Machine disk, which I can share from the NAS Pro, uh, and it, it works as a Time Machine disk. Yeah, cool stuff. So, I think that's about it. That's all the really big things that are going on here. Not a lot has changed in the past couple months, so you haven't missed much, but I have been selling off some stuff like the server rack, so... Over time, you might see a couple little things disappear, and, uh... At least you'll know what that is. Just, I'm getting rid of them, because I don't need them. Anyway, guys, <coughs> excuse me. I think that's about it for this one. I've done a lot of driving today, so I'm pretty beat, and I think the dog is pretty beat. Let's see if he's... Where's the mouse? This is very much a right-handed mouse, and I'm trying to use it left-handed. I think the dog's going to be pretty tired. He had a, a big day of not only traveling and uh, getting pet, but playing with children, and he loves children. So... There he is. He's looking out the window right now, being all adorable and whatnot. So, all right, guys, that's it for this one. I thank you very much for watching, and I will most likely see you, well, post another video before the new year, but if I don't, we'll see you later. Uh, yeah, awkward ending. Bye!